The widespread use of cannabis and its increased potency are associated with a rise in cannabis-related psychiatric conditions, according to a new University of Maryland School of Medicine review article published in the New England Journal of Medicine. Dr. David Gorolik says cannabis use can cause psychological harm. Which can range from cannabis use disorder, what we used to call an addiction to cannabis. So yes, this is a question I'm often asked by uh, not, only, not only if colleagues, but patients, even family members. Um, most people who use cannabis don't, but some people do develop an addiction to cannabis. But also use of cannabis can induce uh, symptoms that resemble other psychological problems, such as depression, anxiety, or even psychosis. Due largely to legalization, marijuana use is on the rise, with nearly one in five Americans over the age of 12 using cannabis in 2021. It seems obvious that the more people use cannabis, particularly more people who use it heavily, uh, the more likely we are to have people with cannabis-related disorders and toxicities. It's also of concern to me and other experts in the field that the potency of cannabis that's available in the U.S. now, and by potency we usually mean the content of THC, which is the major, not the only, but the major psychoactive chemical in cannabis, has increased substantially over the past two or three decades. Dr. Gorelick recommends that doctors screen all of their patients for possible cannabis-related problems. And if the screen is positive, they should get further evaluated to see if they actually do have a problem uh, stemming from their cannabis use. For the University of Maryland School of Medicine, I'm Larry Roberts.